So first of all, let's go ahead and start with TEAR, the, the Arabidopsis informa Information Network. And what I want to emphasize here is that if you, if you look under Tools, what you see there is that there, there are a number of tools that are now being exported to the crops that we work on. And so Alan mentioned, brief, uh, mentioned briefly GBrowse. Heather's going to give us uh, an introduction to the GBrowse that's been set up for tomato sequences in the, in the next talk. Um, there are Synteny viewers and other words viewers that can help us look at, at genomes in a comparative way between species, sequence viewers, map viewers. There are metabolic pathway databases, and so these are useful databases if you want to get at candidate genes in your organism. So you could pull out, say, all of the genes in the carotenoid biosynthetic pathway from Arabidopsis and then go look for their homologs in tomato and use that as a starting point for marker development. There are tools for sequence comparison, like the basic local alignment search technique, or BLAST. It can be run as a distributed resource, so you can paste a sequence of choice into there and identify homologs that way. Um, and so again, what I would encourage you to do is, if you're interested in knowing more about these resources, is spend a little bit of time looking at these tools um, and, and then asking what they can do for you. <coughs> 